This is one Baker 7 responding to a DB on the pier. There it is. Fox, you want to step back, please? Everybody try and clear a path. All right, give us some room. Thank you. Thanks. Looks like Leo had a good reason to be afraid. Yeah, there goes our only link to the bandit. Maybe not. I wonder if that truck's still in the impound. Hey, Lieutenant. Hey, forensics came up with a hit for a bandit. Printing Leo's truck was a good idea. Yeah, I would have thought of it sooner if I wasn't so tired. Our bad guy is one Robert the Rocket Richling. The Rocket? I knew I'd seen those moves before. You know this guy? Well, not really. I know of him. Actually, he even used to be a pretty big fan. Bobby Richling was one of the most talented riders on the pro circuit until they kicked him off. What for? For not showing up for competitions, assaulting a judge, and finally for using drugs. It's a shame, too, because he was silk on the bike. In his prime, nothing could stop him. Except the drugs. Yeah. You'll see in there he's got multiple arrests for possession of crystal meth. Great, a meth user. Those guys that kill you just for looking at them funny. fell asleep on duty. If this was the army, I'd be shot. Wow, tough army. <laughs> hey, so tell me, huh? How are things between you and Melissa? It's hell. Hell. Seven times. Seven times she did it last night. She said to me seven. I said, no, no, Melissa. Five is my limit, but she wouldn't listen. <laughs> what do they feed you in the homeland? Oh, DC, you've got to help me. You've got to get me out of this. Oh, wait a minute, Elvis, huh? Wait a minute. I already did my part, right? And for that, I will be grateful for the rest of my life. And at the rate I'm going, I should be dead in a half hour. Please. Well, have you tried to just say no? <laughs> well, give it some time, little buddy. Maybe you can just gracefully fade out of her life. Maybe. But she moved in last night. You got problems, Elvis. you want us to dance? You mean together? Together, separately. Makes no difference to me. I want you to dance. I like to watch. Sure. <laughs> I'm not touching you. Do it and you die. <laughs> Baby. <laughs> It'll be more fun if you dance with me. Come on. Up close and personal. I really like it. Huh? You really like it, right? <laughs> yeah. You're a good dancer. Can I join? Ooh, a sandwich. <laughs> What are you doing? <laughs> hey, Kid Kitty. See, so you found my little friend. I certainly did. <laughs> I take a wild cat in you. Freeze, please!
your pants? Stay on them! under arrest for the sale of illegal weapons. <sighs> Graham, Dorothy. What a pleasant surprise. What? Cuff him. When the robberies began six weeks ago, they were happening about once every eight days. But in the last week, the time between robberies is down to just about once every three days. So how'd it go with Steven and his parents afterwards? Good. Ladies, do you mind? Sorry. Sorry. This means that Bobby can't go as long between fixes anymore. So I figure he's got to hit within the next day or two. And since he doesn't have Leo in his green truck, that means he's going to have to rely on our regular traffic bottlenecks here, right here, and here. We'll have to split up in two teams to cover it all. So, Chris, you and Corey get caught up to speed as soon as you can, and you'll cover down here. Lieutenant and I will cover the rest. Nice work, TC. Thanks for picking up the slack. All right, let's hit the street.